here we are. Hello, folks. Hello. Hey, guys. What's up? So, you know me, Pontus, Ponytus, um, the Diamond Hunter, all the ki cool nicknames you got for me. I've got my, my cool buddy here, Arthur. Uh, hey. If you haven't met him before, maybe you could give them a quick little brief. Yeah, sure. Uh, so I'm Arthur, a uh, game designer on Call of the Wild. Yes. Uh, I, I, I hope that a few of them start to know my face. By yeah, now. you've been here a couple of times <laughs> yeah, now, yeah. right? So we say a lot of things asking about shotguns and stuff. And uh, we do have a new uh, little reveal today. Yeah. I'm going to do like this. I'm going to pull my inventory up. And we'll have a look. So pretty much we got the Miller model 1891. Which is uh, a pretty cool looking lever action uh, shotgun um, that we're gonna look at. Um, can you tell us anything about that? Yeah, sure. Uh, so, the first thing to know is probably that it's a 10 gauge shotgun. Um, so, I I it's the biggest shotgun in the game for now and the most powerful one. And it's also like something that we didn't have before. So, we're yeah, pretty psyched about it. Um, I think out of the pack is probably my fa my personal favorite, but I, I'm a little biased towards like lever actions in general. Yeah, so I can get that. They're they're <laughs> really awesome. So what we got, we're gonna look at it again. So pretty much we got three different kinds of shot for for uh, yeah, this so shotgun. So, so it's kind of the classic birdshot, buckshot, and slugs. Yes. Um, and yeah, uh, as you can see, also they come in brass shells, um, which is like kind of pretty accurate for the period it was made for. Um, yeah. However, like their modern um, brass cartridges, so they're, they're smokeless, uh, it's not uh, black powder. I just love the look yeah. at those. So, if we're really lucky, there actually are three black tails here, so I'm gonna just crouch up here. Yeah, I, I hope they didn't spook in, in the meantime. I oh didn't. no, they're, they're still there. Boom. Bye bye. Bye bye. Will I get the third one? Yep. All right. There's no game sound though. That's strange. No hmm. game sound. Yeah. Let uh, me uh, it, it check there. that out. Though that's strange. It just disappeared. I guess. Um, you can still hear us talk though. So give it a second, and we'll try to figure the sound settings out. All right. We can do like yeah, this. Yeah. At least you get you get to see three really cool. Uh, nice shots from me though so we're gonna see here we go and uh, sorry guys the the shotgun isn't actually silent <laughs> 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 no there's no suppressors not just yet we know that uh, that you want it so uh, we'll talk can about that hear us just very quietly oh again oh, all right we can try to now it should be a lot louder i'm guessing no like this is a lot better right so i guess you can hear us yeah. better now now it's just the sound which is strange. Nope, nope, yeah. nope, 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 nope. That's Mac. Can we hear well, it? Well, I mean, worst case scenario, we're gonna get the Mac out again. Well, they can hear us, but they can't oh hear yeah, the they game can hear sound, which is really yeah. strange. Hmm. As I said, we're just working, I don't know, 10 minutes ago. Um, mm. So let's see if we can figure it out. Uh, yeah, is the audio. We can. Music or that then maybe do we have anything so this is what's scaring me that we uh, can't can hear you uh, g can you hear us guys oh i think they can hear us no problem it's just the game sound that we can't really figure out which is so strange i think that maybe someone has been down here and played with our stuff we'll see what we can do because everything is set as it should be hmm which is hmm. strange uh, yeah. Hmm. Uh, yeah uh in the meantime guys if you have questions i guess you can shoot them uh, i will do my best to answer it while pontus figures the sounds out yeah we'll see if we're gonna be able to fix that actually um that is so strange we're gonna do like this guys first of all i'm gonna show you the animals that i just uh, took with this nice shotgun as you saw they went straight down and when we're done with that i'm gonna try to just restart the game and see if we can yeah, put back Graham sound that's the audio damn you Graham. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, maybe that was his uh, his last uh, maybe, final yeah. goodbye for us. So he's sitting there in the UK somewhere just laughing at us, going at this. Anyway, you can see I took this fella right out. You can see a nice little spread of the pellets. Uh, nine hits. Okay. So two sound. I didn't get the organ hit though. But even though it went straight down. So let's accept that. So let's see where is uh, that? We already your true XP released this update. Uh, no, they're not ready yet. They're th they're gra getting along pretty well. So uh, we hope to release them soonish, uh, but not in this update anyway. So where did they scoot off? Probably around here somewhere. There we go. Oh, poor How fella fell into the water. How long does it take to make a weapon like this? Uh, it, it kind of depends on the weapon. Uh, when it's like completely new, uh, like the muzzle loader, um, it takes a it takes a while, um, a few months probably. Um, but when it's like another a new ball action rifle, it's um, a bit quicker because we don't have to do a whole new animation system for it. So yeah, there's there's definitely that. But yeah, it, it takes some time. From um, the initial design, like deciding what weapon do we want to do, or like do we translate it from real life into the game, uh, and then there's all the modeling, animating, and testing that goes in it. So yeah, probably uh, probably a few months. Okay. All right, so starting up the game again. Let's see. I can nearly hear the game sound. That's nice though, because I couldn't hear it at all at this point which was super strange probably yep. gonna turn that down so no one goes deaf we're we're so just starting game. up the game now any second guys let's see do we hear anything the, the sound is not meant to be work in progress um full population reset uh no there is there is no population reset planned um if you have like problems with your population, uh, please send us a report and we'll, or even better, a save file and we'll look into it. Uh, if we find anything at work, uh, that would be uh, pretty nice for us uh, to figure out what's going on. All right. Oh, well, um, to be honest, I think we have to do without sound today. Um, well, that's first and foremost. It sucks, but that's the way it is. And I think we rather should focus on looking at the shotguns. Yeah. Then me trying to fix the sound, which is something I know nothing about. Anyway, so that was the um, the slug that I used, and it took them right off. Um, we do have a need zone here. We see it's between 12 and 13, so we're gonna take a quick rest in the in my little tent, and then we're gonna go look if see if we can get some birdies. Uh, will we get another Africa map in the future? Uh, maybe. I, I I can't say anything on that right now. Is there no sound in the weapon bag? There is sound in the weapon <laughs> bag. It's just uh, technical problems. Yeah, probably. The thing is, we just moved studio and stuff haven't really worked out since then. Um, and Graham, who were the technical guy here, he is not around anymore. So we're gonna see if we can get some real sound technicians to have a look at this. Mm. Um, it's not really okay that the sounds work. What are the ammo classes? Very good question. Uh, so for the bird shot, it's class one as usual. Um, the buck shot is classes four to seven. So it's not usable on like the smallest deers um, environment, uh, but anything from black tail, white tail, um, and uh, and upwards is uh, is fine uh, up to class seven. Then. And the slugs are classes six to nine. Uh, so this is the only shotgun ammo uh, that can take down a class nine animal. Which is definitely like the which big selling point for 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 the shotgun. Really nice. So if we look at that, we can see the slug got the range of 50 meters, which I think is pretty nice. Yeah. You have to crawl and you have to um, be a bit sneaky to use that to get yeah, that close actually, um, which gives the hunting uh, 
bit more, a bit harder perhaps. We got back shot also 25 meters and the bird shot. Yeah, as yeah, well. yeah. You you have to get close, but it packs a, a really good punch. So if you get, if you manage to sneak out on that thousand before, yeah, it's gonna go down quick. Right? Really nice if you use uh, tree stamps or something, and and uh, colors, and you can get the the bucks uh, or those come up really close. Yeah. Why did you not add a modern muscle loader? Well. Yeah, it, it, it really was a, a choice, um, but we felt like the the old uh, school muzzle loader had a, a bit more unique flavor to it, and it, it fit the, tem the theme of this pack better, um, which you can probably start figuring out by now, uh, given the two guns we have uh, revealed. Yes, it's um, kind of a red thread, so to say, a common theme. Yeah. Clayton uses a 10 gauge in real life. That's cool, man. That's cool. So, so is a bird shot more powerful? Uh, yes, it is. Uh, so it's it's more geared towards uh, like the bigger birds, like um, um, the 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 Canada goose and also another bird that might be coming soon to fall of the line. Yeah, but you can also take ducks with it, of course. It is, so hopefully we'll get some ducks here. It's a bit early, perhaps, for that uh, that little nude zone, but they should be hopefully coming soon. So you're going to see, we got the... Where do we got the duck collar? It's on number four. Well, well, it's mid thread of the range, and absolutely, because now you can have a um, lever-action rifle, yeah. a lever-action shotgun, and a revolver. So you got that. Maybe uh, it's just a trapper outfit that's missing. Yeah, that's true. Maybe you know, we should the make one. The Davy Crockett style, yeah, all that, that would stuff be would be cool. super cool. And then you go hunting in Yukon and you're all set. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. So, well let's see. Do we have any... Do we have any Is this cool weapon number two of the pack? Yes, it is. Uh, the first one, because you missed it, was... Uh, uh, Civil War era muzzle loader that yes. we showed off last week. And it looked and like this. Yeah. And because I actually got it equipped. So I for me I, I equipped the Luna because I think it's just awesome with the silver and you got the that kinda oily uh, finish to it. It's just lovely. Yeah. And you got nice cool. range and it packs heat. Oh yeah, definitely. Like I I, I think in, in general all weapons in this pack pack heat. That's for sure. So, will we see any duckies? Otherwise, we'll go on a little uh, blacktail hunt. I got some nice positions uh, looked out, and um, let's see what we can do. But first, I want to see those duckies. Uh, yeah, so on the topic of bugs, we're, <laughs> we're fixing them as, as fast as we can, to be honest. Uh, so there's going to be a batch of bug fixing coming out at the same time as weapon back, uh, as usual. And bug fix you can expect bug fixes for every patch, uh, as usual. We that's something we're working on constantly. Yeah, just because uh, someone is designing a new weapon or s or uh, some structures or something like that doesn't mean that other parts of the team can't work with bugs. Yeah, so it's a uh, it's a uh, parallel work. So there's always big focus on uh, on fixing the bugs. Yeah. And if you do find a bug that you don't need, just um, write to us on social and we'll make sure to to take a look at it. Hey, we got TK in the chat. Hey, TK, nice to see you, man. Hope you have a really nice vacation, buddy. We miss you a lot. Yeah, we, we, we figured you, you might like today's weapon. Yeah, it's going to be... Hopefully you'll be here next week and you can fix the sound, right? Hopefully. <laughs> Now I'm sure we got a lot of good sound technicians here to take a look. It might be helpful if you put a list of all the bugs that you're aware of. Um, yeah, it could be. Although I think more than a list of all the bugs, a list of all the bugs that we're currently working on may be better. It would be nice. Yeah. Alright, this is pretty. Uh, uh, cool. I think I'll I'll ping Phil about it. We'll we'll see what we can do for sure. Do do 
do where all the duck is at? I was here scouting just before with sound and there were a lot. So hopefully they will come in soon. So where did I put the duck caller? Was that five? That was five. Why well, another shotgun says all your five? Yes, but it is the first lever action one and it's also the first ten gauge one. Yes. So yeah, there's definitely some novelty in there. So that's uh, we're taking the shotgun to a completely different level. Yeah. So we'll see. When can we buy a new shotgun? Well, when the weapon pack releases. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> And um, which, well, given that we can show you them to you in game, uh, you can infer it is soon, but we don't have a real state yet. Yeah, so it holds uh, three uh, oh. shots, or what do you call it? Cartridges? Uh, uh, shells, yeah. Shells, yeah. Yeah, it can hold three shells. Uh, the magazine technically could hold more, but uh, yeah, it's limited by anything worth reaching, pretty much. So, oh, what we got there? A little moose. Is there going to be a third weapon in the pack? Yes, there is. It is, it is, it's gonna be nice. Yeah, um. So, let's skip this spot and go to another little blind and check yeah. it out if we can. Uh, if we can find back there. Yeah, if we can exit. Thank you. Just look how nice I did with all this little Yeah, it's a, it's a pretty nice decoys. little duck family. Yeah, yeah. Well, all right, let's skip that place. Um, we got some nice. We can check it out down here, maybe. Yeah. Let's see if we got uh, got anything nice. Yeah, and um, yeah. Well, one thing that I am thinking of um, that I really like about that gun, uh, the dual shotgun, mm -hmm. um, so like when you actually like. Um, actuate the lever action, you can see um, the action opening and the carriage cycling in there. So oh, that's, that's cool that's though. That's really cool. That's yeah. awesome. I think that's my favorite part about this weapon. That's really cool. That's really cool. So where did I go? All right, I went here. So this spot though, I'm a bit unsure about, but I've seen that there could be ducks around, so we'll have a quick little look, see if we got anything. Little sneak. Uh, plug in the secondary microphone. Should please. we try uh, that? Can, can't you? Can't you hear us nicely with the ones we have right now? All right. Any duckies? Weapon pack four. Uh, you could say that, although it's not the name, but given it. Bum, bum, bum. No birds today. No birds today. It would be nice to show off the bird shots, but um, you know how it is, though. So what's, did you say that the um, slug goes all the way up to, was it level 8 or 9? Uh, sorry, can you repeat? The, the slug, wha wha yeah. wha wha was that level uh, class 9? Yeah, it goes up to class 9. Ooh, that's nice though. Yeah, it is, uh, so the slug is class 6 to 9, um, but ah. four the bird shot is 4 to 7 and the uh, bird shot is 1. Alright, alright. Uh, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna bring that to Parque Fernando. Oh no, what did I do? Um, and then I'm gonna go hunt some cave buffalo. That and that's gonna good. be awesome. Finally, I'm gonna take my revenge. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I've been so upset with them. Been so upset with them always killing me. Like, it's so annoying. Late for all of those. We're gonna take a little nap. Maybe eight 
30, it's about time I get up in the morning. Let's see what we got here. Have we got anything? So this is our uh, interesting question actually. Laserborn from YouTube says, why is only three shells when the one in classical six? So is there a yeah. difference why we use three or six shells is depending on well, I guess it depends on the weapon, though. Yeah, exactly. So, so I'm not sure exactly why we decided six on on classic because I, I I wasn't working the year then. Um, so yeah, we decided to limit it to three uh, based on like uh, real life limitations. Um, so it's more of a legal thing because uh, a shotgun can technically hold more shells than that, but um, it's limited to three in uh, quite a few. Yeah, states in the United States mostly. Ah, uh, all right, all right. Yeah, yeah. So it's a legal thing, and we 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 chose to adhere to that. Uh, we already have a, a few weapons for which it is the case. That makes a lot of sense. So let's uh, look out at this little. Let's see if we can find anything out here. Oh, we got Phil in the chat as well. Hey, Phil. So apparently there are people who still have trouble hearing us. That's weird. Oh, should we try the Yeti instead? Uh, maybe. I guess we can. Could you plug that in? Yeah. So I just uh, plug in the USB. Should be yes. Okay. I'm gonna try. Let's see if it works better. I like try to sneak down here. See if we got some nice animals to take on. If I need to do, I'm not sure actually. Hmm, is it muted? It, it doesn't seem to be. I don't know. Hmm. Do we have any animals here? Good morning to Michigan. That's nice. All the way from the US and A. Oh, there we got a big moose over there. Maybe we can stalk that. Try to get it. Nice, he's sweet and calm. Careful. Let's look the map. All right. Uh, so, Keith, uh, what question have you been asking? Uh, sorry, we, we often miss questions because it, it, it goes very fast in chat. Yeah, we try to do four shots at a time, so it's not personal if we miss any of your questions. Now I want that moose, so how let's see how we can sneak up on it. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm not sure if the microphone is working. I don't think so either. I don't know how Graham managed to get that to work. As I said, I don't do that. I do Excel. Yeah. Any update on the tri diamond scoring, specifically Blacktail deer? Uh, so like we are reviewing uh, scoring in general uh, following the scoring update. Uh, so th there may be things changing there, yeah. Um, but it's not very specific to the black tail. It's we're looking at all the animals. So too bad there's water in between here, and Moosey is so far right. I'm gonna try to sneak up here, get it across the water, and let's see. There's any way to cross later. Hmm. That would be interesting. Can a scope be mounted on it? No, so there is no scope for uh, the lever action shotguns. Which is um, a funny 
thing when I tried this out before. I was like, all right, which scope can I attach? Yeah, and yeah I, I basically tried to try all the scopes and nothing worked. Yeah, no, um, we have no scope that can be attached on it. Um. But that's I, I think that makes sense since the range yeah, is yeah, isn't that far. Because so like we, we looked in, in real life, um, like the shotgun we based that on was a Winchester uh, 8087. And we couldn't find like an example of uh, a scope that's made for that shotgun, which makes sense. Well, if you're I way. if you're using uh, uh, a shell that got 25 meters range, I think it's a bit yeah, overkill yeah. to have a scope exactly. on that. Maybe I'd be guessing maybe like a a, a red dot or a reflex sight could uh, could make sense, but mm. still that that wouldn't maybe go with the with the. Yeah, no, of that age. yeah, no, definitely. Uh, because so since it has no rail or anything, like we need um, a special uh, scope for it, like we do uh, um, with the uh, lever action uh, rifle. But uh, here we couldn't find like an example of uh, scope made specifically for a lever action shotgun. Let's see who, where's Musa at? Scoot off from somewhere, maybe. It's supposed to be there, but it's the waypoint, so we can go right. Will we have upgrades in animal behavior or injury model? Uh, we're actually looking at um, things that we can improve for the future. Uh, like, there's no specific plans or date planned yet, but uh, it's something that we would like to work on for sure. So we keep sneaking. Is this black powder as well? Uh, no, so um, the shells are like brass shells um, to give the vintage feeling, but they're actually modern uh, brass shells. So they're, uh, they are filled with smokeless powder. So you can expect uh, like performance that is in line with the other uh, rifles, the other shotguns. That's nice. Right, soon I should be fairly close, but we need to get within 50 meters, so... Is this a lever action? Yes, it is. Right. Let's see a bit more. Can we cross here? We should be able to, right? Uh, coyote mission, Leighton. It has few to use the 270. Ah, uh, good catch. Um, do you have the name of that mission? Uh, and like, like the best thing to do really is to send a, a ticket to support, because that way it's entered in our tracking system and it's much easier to keep track of. Yes. Like I I if you find missions that don't work because of the new scoring system, that means we've missed them uh, during our testing passes. So definitely like raise a bug, uh, send a message to. Uh, either like the community team or raise a ticket for it uh, and we'll look into it for sure. So give me a second, we're just gonna have a little guy removed from the shot. Thank you. that thank you speed hunter and goodbye please be nice people all right we have not yeah. odor reducer well i think i actually used the uh, sample eliminator a bit yeah I I we'll I if we can find animals to shoot at we'll, we'll definitely go to the shooting range to <laughs> show you at <laughs> least how it shoots but there there's supposed to be a uh, fairly big moose just up here somewhere if you haven't scooted off but i think it's around here somewhere we're gonna keep sneaking on it oh there it is now that's mommy moose there's a daddy moose here somewhere too so anything Will there be a more precise 360 sound uh, feature for animal tracking? 
Um, we're lo currently looking at improving the sound of animals, uh, especially footsteps. So, All right. uh, so yeah, hopefully this is gonna make it into the game soon. Uh, should make tracking the animals a bit a bit easier. But yeah, the sound team is l currently looking at areas where they can improve stuff in the game. So if you have like requests or ideas for that, um, I guess yeah, feel free to send them in, and we'll we'll see if we can make. Uh, make them into the game. So I see question here about release date and for now there's uh, no release date but uh, be sure that we will uh, let you know. Yeah the, the release date is soon as, as usual. But we're gonna blast that all over social so you're not gonna miss it I promise. The only thing I'm missing now is uh this nice animal to harvest up here. You guys can't even fix stream, yeah, sorry. <laughs> None of us is a sound engineer, sadly. Yeah. Maybe in my next life I'll be a sound yeah, engineer. Yeah, maybe. So, where is the moose? We can stand up there so uh, uh. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, when are you going to solve the multiple errors and bugs on mobile player? Um, well, we, we try to fix them continuously, uh, like we pump out bug fixes with each update. Um, we know there are quite a few in the games. We, we've seen, like Phil said, um, in Reddit a few days ago, we've seen uh, an increase in the number of live bugs uh, over like the back half of last year. Uh, so we're trying to put together a plan to address that. Um, we're 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 shifting priorities around to try and put out more bug fixes, but it it takes time to act up on that one. Right now, all we need is some moves. What is the DLC name? We got a question. We I think uh, we uh, haven't. Uh, yeah, I don't think it has been revealed yet. Yes, so that's uh, we're gonna keep that little secret for you. Yeah, I, I, I think we're probably gonna reveal this one at the same time as the uh, third weapon. Ooh, you are free to speculate on what that third weapon is. Mm -hmm. I want the moose, give me the moose. Show the other variants of the 10 gauge. Sorry? Um, they are asking to show the for us to show the different variants. Of Let's the do that okay. then. And then maybe we'll scoot off and look for animals somewhere else. Um, so what I got, I got the sheriff. This is a nice little brownish... Uh, thing with these golden details as you can see. Yeah, it has golden, well, I think gilded is the appropriate term. Gilded metal engravings on, on the side of it. it. It's really nice. So this is nice. And then we got the deputy, which is more brownish. Um, can I still got the, the brass, the brass details. Then we got the, um, we got the third one, which I don't have equipped because I, I felt that I needed a 50 cal just to be safe. So maybe <laughs> we're gonna keep that yeah. as a little secret uh, for. Uh, I guess we can show it at the guys. end of the stream, yeah. Yeah, that we can do probably also. But first of all, we need something to shoot at. So let's see if we can track. This. No, that's also female. Not the male one. Any plans to upgrade the internet with tablet? Uh, what do you mean by that? <laughs> fly. Um, I can't jump into fly mode right now, though. So I have to fly some some other time. So with the three weapons, uh, so far we've only revealed two. Uh, we've revealed uh, the muzzle loader last week, uh, so it's a Civil War era muzzle loader. 
And this week we're revealing um, the 10 gauge shotgun, which is a lever action shot. So and the third one is still a secret for me, but be assured it, it is coming soon. Like that, then we get some more people who can't behave. You know the rules, guys. I wish the moose know the rules too. So some 10 gauge goose hunt actually, maybe we could do that, although we would have to change the rules. Oh, Alright, let's uh, see if we can find some other animals here. We get Oh uh, yeah, a tablet has a larger screen. And yeah, okay. So you mean like an actual tablet? Um, no, so there is no plan to to change the internet to another format just because. Uh, well, everything that has been made into the game so far has been made to work on this internet. And changing it would uh, be uh, like it would be a big endeavor. Um, for uh, like the games would be too little, I think, compared to the cost. So, did we just have a deer here somewhere? Let's see. Any chance we can hear you shoot the new 10 gauge? Uh, well, <laughs> we would like you to hear the new 10 gauge, but uh, we have some problems, sadly, and we don't know how to fix them. little deer. Is it possible to add the intermate to the ATV? That's actually an interesting idea. That would be interesting though, like a little uh, display in the front. Yeah, so that could be nice. Definitely. That's not bad actually. That's not a bad idea at all. Is the in-game audio done? Yes, it is, Sally. get a break action revolver. Um, I mean, we have nothing against it. it. It's definitely something that we could that could make its way into the game at some point. What kind of revolver? Um, break open. You know, you where you break ah, it open you and you ah, yeah, right, you can change right, the right, cylinder right. and everything. Ah, I get it. That's cool. That's cool. Voice works fine with no game sounds, and those are people are saying they can't hear us talk. Um. Well, I know for a fact last week that people who watched uh, on mobile phones for some reason had problems, um, while others who were watching on a PC or uh, or a Mac or something did not have problems, which is super strange. The voice is really quiet still. Uh. Well, we maxed out yeah. everything that we could, so unfortunately we can't do anything about that right now. Hmm, this spot was also empty. Where are all the bucks? Maybe we should go back where we started, where we had quite a lot of... I wonder what that buzzing noise is. Yeah, I don't know. I, I guess it's maybe just because we boosted the level. Yeah, because so the much. exactly. So we just take that yeah. the cable noise yeah, in yeah, some I way. So. Right, we don't really have any kind of animals here. Oh yeah, I think didn't we have anything here? Or was it just flowers? No. Oh. Fooled. So what time is this meat zone? I 
when can we uh, expect a hot fix for scoring 2.0? Um, so we don't have a hot fix plans, but we have fixes for scoring 2.0 coming with uh, the next patch at the same time as uh, weapon back. Right, so this should be some deer around here. Somewhere. Does any of the devs hunt in real life? Yes, they do. Um, yeah, we all the way from like our CEO down to community managers. There's a lot of uh, real life hunters. Uh, yeah, we we have a bit of everything. We have people who like always hunt it. We have people who I think became interested in hunting after after working after there. After playing with this, yeah, absolutely. Exactly. And we have people who don't hunt but still like enjoy the game. I know that that's my case. Like I don't really like the idea of going hunting in your life. But I really like learning about hunting and how it's done and having the opportunity to, you know, experience it in game without having to actually kill him. Right, so we got the moose, but it's so far away. Will we be able to get within fifty meters? That's the question. So I'm I'm wondering if we um if you shoot from outside the 50 meters, will will the still take damage or how much damage loss? Uh, will yes, they definitely. Will so, 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 so the range that you can see um, in the stat cards um, in the store, uh, this is like the effective range. So this is uh, in effect the range, the maximum range that we uh, recommend using this weapon at for the maximum effect. Um, past that, you're you're likely gonna see a drop in effectiveness, but that doesn't mean that it cannot kill an animal past that range. Usually, like the recommended range is based on both the power of the weapon, but also like the accuracy of the ammunition, right. etc. Yeah. Interesting. The more you know, then. So it's so far away, but they're still there though, the Moses, so we should hopefully be able to get them. We should be able... No ducks around, no. Nope, nope, nope. Hey there, Yaxi. Welcome to today's stream. All right, I have to take the bar. You can run. Let's have a little jog. So, muscle loader and shotgun. Yes, that's uh, that's right. Uh, twist 3D. What's the third weapon? Well, I guess you have to wait and see, yeah, right? Yeah, I guess it's a we're surprise for next Yeah, time. we're not going to spoil that today. We're not. Yeah. Um, we have 15 minutes left, so I guess if we. Yeah, we we're gonna try to stock the moose or we go to the shooting range. Yeah. So, first, we're gonna see if we can get the moose just behind this creek. Otherwise, we'll travel to the range and just blast. But if you were really lucky and saw like the first 30 seconds, you saw me take out three bucks, so. Okay, being super excited about the weapon, I'm calling it the uh, wooden crossbow. <laughs> yeah, I'm excited about that one too, and I know a lot of people have been talking about that. So it's a it's a nice little secret that we're gonna keep. A muscle loader pistol. Is that even a thing? Yes, yes, it is. Is it? Yeah. Well, yeah, that's true. Those uh, the old uh, pirate pistols, I guess. Uh, no, but uh, even we revolvers, like, the like there, are, there are revolvers that uh, used to shoot like patch rumbles actually with black powder and stuff. Alright, oh yeah. that's cool. The more you know. So, what are the chances that the moose have run away when I come within seeing distance again or can see them clearly? Nope, it's there. It's calm, it's drinking. It's 250. Oh no, now the wind direction is starting to change. What's the word on turkeys? Uh, well, it's confirmed that we want to put them into the game, hopefully this year. We don't have uh, any more details than that. At yeah, we're not going to. At this time. 
Oh, like look it's at in that. the works is the, the current Hey, we can, we can do, we can oh, take nice. this little rabbit. I just need to yeah. uh, change, change to bird shot. Real quick. There we go. Yeah. Bam! And he's out. And wasn't there another one? There we go. Nope. Alright, at least we got one little rabbit here. Yeah, I guess we can show the reload then. Yeah, alright, well, bam! And yeah, uh, one cool thing about the gun is the real animation is actually pretty different um, depending on the, the, the levels of your perk that speed up the reload. Um, like if you if you have the lowest level perk, uh, you're gonna reload the shells one by one. Yeah. Uh, all in the magazine, and then cycle the gun once to put one uh, one round into the chamber. All right. Um, but if you are like a pro reloader. We're gonna just put one in the magazine and then two directly into the elevator, ah. and that way when you close, there's gonna be one that's gonna go di directly into, into the, the chamber. chamber. Oh, that's yeah, cool. And you don't have to cycle the gun; it's much much quicker. Oh, I like so that. Yeah, like the animation did did a, a crazy job on this. That's one. pretty darn awesome, I have to say. So obviously, I scared the moose away when I shot that hair. And there's. Anything around here? Like a bird. Nope, they ran off. Oh wait, there we go. There we go. Is it on its way back or we can do like this. I think let's see where I got the moose collar equipped. Number six. You just have to add the sound when you make the recap. <laughs> That's how it sounds. The moose collar. <laughs> Something like that. Let's see, did that work? I know, so the buzz, it, uh, we think it comes from just from the fact that we have boosted the levels of everything like crazy, uh, so you can hear us. So yeah, I, I w I it's probably just the um, cable noise that's, that's getting boosted as well. Yeah, static. If there is a s uh, this something that we'd like to see and is your way to cycle through your ammo for your one weapon, uh, we are looking into something. Um, like there is no concrete plans yet, uh, but we're aware it is a pain, especially on consoles, and we are looking at ways to improve it. That we are. <laughs> Can you guys release a short video on Twitter later showing the sounds? Uh, I guess maybe. We That's could do not that. a bad idea, actually. So I'm gonna try to work that out. We're gonna maybe do a short little video where we just blast all the shotguns. You will see the reloads and hear the sounds and smokes and everything. So we're gonna try to set that up and post later, right? So where? There it is. All right. It's not the biggest little moose. It's also super nervous, which is not good. Hmm, where did I have the samples and iron right? Did we oh we got a, a one much closer. Look at oh that. Oh yeah, yeah. Look at that. It's I didn't see that one. It's just within range as well. The sneaky moose. Perfect. Now we'll see the the fur is so good. Yeah, do you have the correct ammo? Yeah. Anyway. That should I hit it pretty good, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Nah, this is the rabbit, right? Let's try to track the the moose that we got here. It was just within range, so it should uh, should have worked kind of nice, I guess. Let's see. Did we? Can I see some blood here somewhere? Oh, here we go. Blood rate very, very low. low. Yeah. Hmm, did I just miss the, I the think lungs, you perhaps? Maybe you eat the shoulder blade. Or yeah, 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 could be like that. All right, let's see if we can chase it, chase it, chase it down. Through that. Yeah, do you have the perk to to see uh, like how much health it has left? Let's try to, yeah. Good, fast Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, we're probably going to have to chase this for quite a while, I'm guessing. If we can even see where it went. I think 
Netflix. They got the shoulder blades there. Yeah, I'm guessing. I'm guessing. So we got ten minutes left. Should we uh, just go to the shooting range and blast? Um, I I guess so. Yeah. Yeah, we can do that. This will be so a good idea. Yeah, so we need to change reserve then, I guess. Ooh, map, 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 map. I got a system. Uh, nope. Damn, I always played the same reserve over and over, so. Can I like to set my menu? So, there's a range at the uh, Parque Fernando, right? Uh, yeah, but we probably want to go to each building. Uh, yeah, alright. To go, let's go there. Let's see if I have. Uh, each building range is better than Barca Fernando. Yeah. Barca Fernando is there for the bows. So, since this is the development build, nothing is unlocked. So, I have to look at this for a little second. Any day now. Yeah, uh, do you have the flight mode? Since it's a uh, dev build. We, if we're lucky, uh, we, sh we should have that. Let's see if we can just come yeah. down to the ground. We should be able to scoot right there. Oh, it moves real what slow. What gauge is it? Uh, it's a 10 gauge, I think. It is. Nope, nope, nope. We there will be no flying today. And I guess the range is so far away. But we'll see. Usually, isn't there a it? Yeah, I can. Isn't there uh, usually uh, a buck standing just down here that they want you to shoot in like the first intromission? I think they usually. Yeah, there it is. We can at least take that out. <laughs> Poor little row there. Yeah, all the uh, class two and three uh, aren't covered by. This shotgun, so oh, it's not. Yeah, though. we won't be able to. Oh, too bad. Forget it. Would score on it. We can shoot it anyway, though. Into some bird. That is for sure. This is the bird uh, bird shot, though. So we need to get yeah, a bird lot shot closer. <laughs> bird shot won't give very good results, I'm afraid. No, I will die at least. I hope. Are you guys gonna put AR in the game? Uh, I don't think so, right? It, it's not. Uh, I, I don't know. Common like that you have to uh, uh, like a I would never rifle, say never. Right? I would never say never for sure. Yeah, well, on a no long enough timeline, anything is possible. Yeah, so because w we had one in classic, so it definitely could find its way in Call of the Wild. I know that at some point it was uh, a candidate for uh, for split back actually. Yeah. Yeah. I, I in the place of the the third third weapon. So obviously you don't hunt row there with ten gauge slugs, but we're gonna do it anyway for science. Bam. Yeah. That should have took him out straight away though. I don't know. Facing shots are always. Uh, no, we'll see. So hopefully we got a vital so it we'll can see. What we can do, however, is look at that uh, reload animation again. So I'm just gonna blast on two shots here and there. Shove that down. Nice. No organ hit. Hmm. Yeah, so it's not going down. It's the roll there. Yeah, facing shots are, are really not that great, especially. So how's the gun. how's the spread? So I'm guessing yeah, the further distance, the bigger the spread. Yes, yes, uh, as usual with a, a shotgun, but the spread is pretty comparable to what you have on on the 12 gauge. All right. It's just uh, it's got uh, it's got fewer pellets, I think, on on most. Um most of the shots. Yeah, we can see like one just grazed the head, another one oh took yeah. the foot, so the spread is enormous. Yeah, the spread is pretty big. Anyway, it was for science, so now we oh know. Oh yeah, you shot it from 50 meters. So. Yeah, that's true. 
I did use the I did use the 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 slug though. No, it was a it was buckshot. Oh, was yeah. Oh, sorry, yeah. sorry. It was yeah. the buckshot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. Um. But yeah, so it's, it's the buckshot is pretty powerful. Uh, but it has like very few pellets in it, so definitely uh, it's better for sight on shots and and bigger animals. That's awesome, though. So maybe we can find another little deer here to take out. So. Yeah. Uh, okay. Can you see if you can fly to to your ship? No, sorry. Yeah, ah since we're not playing okay. release, we couldn't. Ah, so yeah. Because it is a dev rule. Uh, we uh, can't okay. fly unless we have all those, uh, all those yeah, crazy we overlays. We you just know. have a few minutes left. Uh, yeah. So we're gonna see. Can we find any animal here that we can just shoot that? So, Domenico from Facebook, uh, Francesco isn't here today, H Francesco works with Classic, this is Arthur, and Arthur is our Call of the Wild superstar, and he's been here today to talk about our new shotguns. Yeah, the, uh, the other game designers are, are too shy, and <laughs> don't like strings. <laughs> That's true though, they're easily spooked. Do you have anything down here maybe? Nothing, nothing at all. Or is it? Nope. Nope, 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 nope. All right, we got three minutes left. We're gonna look at this. We're uh, gonna check the inventory, see if we can have a quick recap. So, so we got yeah, uh, recap. Uh, the second weapon of the upcoming weapon pack is a ten gauge uh, lever action shotgun. Um, the it comes with uh, ammo that are equipped for classes. So, the birdshot is class one. The buckshot is class four to seven, and the slugs are class six to nine. Yes, which means you can take all those super big animals with that. Exactly. Um, and so yeah, it is the only shotgun that can take out uh, class nine animals with uh, shotgun ammo. Uh, because the drilling can do it, but with the rifle ammo. Um, and you can get quick kill on bison buffaloes if you are up close and personal. Um, the animation, the real animation, changes pretty significantly with real perks. Um, Which is that that's, yeah. th that's the thing I really like, that it's, it's dynamic on, on what you've learned as a hunter yeah. before. It's just spot on. And it comes with uh, like custom brass shells for it. Yeah, we're gonna maybe have a little close look on the on the shells. Um, there we go. This nice little brass casings is awesome compared to the other more old school kind of thing, uh, or or new school. I would rather say with <laughs> the plastic ones. Yeah, and it comes um, in three variants, which are the sheriff with the um, like the gilded engraving in the in the side of uh, well the action I guess. Um, then we have uh, the deputy, which has a, a brazen metal part, um, which is like it, it's pr we don't see it very nicely no. in the. In the it's more. But it, 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 it's pretty reflective, like it's very polished metal. Yeah. So um, if we look at it, we can see yeah. we have the brass here at the at the the site. And if we have another close look at the other one, we can see that it's more it's grayish, black, yeah. blackish kind of thing with a nice engraving on the side. Um, and then the third variation that we don't have in the inventory here is uh, the ranger, which is a more like basic uh more uh, uh sorry uh I, I want to say sober but it's not <laughs> it's not the correct word um yeah what could you uh, say more more humble i guess yeah yeah, it's yeah more humble is more a good humble, word more simple so I it's um, just a black metal with a, a wooden frame yeah the last one is gonna be a bit of a teaser maybe we can show it off next week maybe you'll see it in the hunt pack 
maybe we'll do a little video. Who knows? It's gonna be fun though. Yeah. Uh, um, I, I really look forward to see the kind of the reaction to this. Episode. Yeah, because it's awesome. That's why. Um, anyway, it's five o'clock. Um, thank you so much for being with us today. Sorry about the sound. We're gonna have some technicians come down and do a revamp of the studio and make sure everything works fine and dandy for next week. Thanks a lot, Arthur, for joining us. My uh, pleasure. It's always such a nice time with you here. And uh, thanks a lot to you guys for being here with us. And uh, see you next week. See you next week. Take care, buddies.